I've been on Xbox for a long time for gaming and wanted to see the hype behind PC gaming. I do many things with my computer that a desktop would not work for me, as I have to move it around frequently and like portability, so I explored into the gaming laptop world. This was a cheaper, yet good option for an entry-level device. Processor I bought the i7-11800H model and this processor seems to be a bit overkill for even some higher-end games. But it's great to have that extra power to multitask as well. I have not had any issues with the processing power. It's fast and smooth. Graphics I'm using the RTX 3050T and I've seen the card likes to run at 100% nearly all the time when in a game but I have had no issues with its capability of running smoothly and not overheating and I haven't even tried any undervolting yet which could improve it more. RAM The 16GB RAM and 4GB VRAM work well together. I use the heavily graphic-related game of Beamin G Drive that requires a lot of RAM to run smooth and have tried several multiplayer games and have never seen the RAM get over 70%, which is pretty good for heavily demanding games. This was plenty of RAM for the gaming I do to keep it running smooth. Overall, this is a great starting laptop for anyone looking for a gaming laptop or something fast for multitasking. Sure, there might be a couple other options with similar price ranges that might perform slightly better. But this one was the lowest price I saw for what you get out of it, and it's been working just fine for me. Negatives The graphics card works really great as mentioned above, but if you use it running at 100% for a couple hours you can completely notice a performance drop because the temperature starts to get too hot. I haven't had it overheat but I have had some slight performance differences after a while of hard use. That's really the only issue, that's not a huge deal, that I've had. And it's correctable by changing up some deeper settings. As I have mentioned, this is a great entry-level laptop. I would not recommend this laptop to anyone that is heavily into gaming. It works great for what I want to do with it, but it would work pretty bad for a professional gamer, not that pros would ever use a laptop for gaming. I am also newer to PC gaming but I'm pretty savvy with computers. So being able to change some settings that the average newer user wouldn't know how to, without YouTube tutorials, have made this laptop perform a little better than out of the box. But these changes I made so far are all settings included on the computer, not third-party software included in this review, meaning anyone can change the basic settings to improve the performance slightly as I have. P.S. I thought I had a dead laptop when it came like other reviewers complained about. I read the review of one person that said you have to jam the power plug and they're really good till it clicks for it to work. I initially thought I pushed hard enough and heard a light snapping sound, but it wouldn't charge or turn on. So I pushed a lot harder and heard it click a lot louder and it started charging perfectly fine and started up right away.